What's up guys? Welcome back to my channel. I haven't done a Ross or TJ Maxx haul with you guys in a while and I know how much we all love shopping at Ross. So I went shopping the other day you guys. I went on a shopping spree. You guys already know when I hit up Ross, I hit up TJ Maxx. I don't know if they're all set up like, like that or maybe it's just a Cali thing. But I don't know why. I feel like the Rosses and TJ Maxx are always like close together. So that's so beneficial for us who are big fans of both. That's kind of like my little therapy, like going to Ross and TJ Maxx. I don't know. Some people like to them it's Target. But I feel like my therapy is like going to Ross or like TJ Maxx. I don't know. That's just me. But all right, guys, let's get right into it. So I guess. We'll start with the Ross haul. For some reason, all our Tupperware has gone missing and we don't know what's up with all our Tupperware, but it's gone. Um, so me and Britt have been trying to rebuild our Tupperware. Um, so I bought this set. I got this 10 piece set from Ross. This one was $7.99. So it's like beneficial to put like your food away, ovio, or like your salsas. And then I got some kitchen stuff. Okay, so I love these, you guys. I don't know what you call this, but you ba I basically, we use this like whenever we're cooking and you know, you use like your spoon, like the wooden spoon to stir the pot or like the food. Um, you know, whenever you set it down, you could put it on here instead of like having to wash it every time or just putting it on like something that this is super beneficial. We already have one, but I wanted to buy a backup one for whenever the other ones like need to get washed. And I like this one too, cause it's kind of thick. It's thicker than the last one I got. But you know what? The last one hasn't broke on me. This one was $4. I always feel like things fall in the food disposal. Like the other day, um, a screw fell in there. Me and Britt had to go in there and try to get the screw out. And you can just imagine, both of us have like long ass nails. Like how, it was just so hard you guys, but I was able to get it out. So anyways, just to avoid any conflict, I bought this silver sink strainer. So that was a must. Cause I was getting tired of sticking my hand in there. And guys like, I told Britt because she was like I was trying to get the screw out and I told Britt like can you like not stand next to the switch I was like I know that you're not gonna do it but I just have trust issues and I, I just feel like what if accidentally like you're like oh let me turn the light on we have switches on both sides and one is for the light and the other one is for the garbage disposal so I feel like I'm a little paranoid because it's even happened to me where I'm like oh I'm gonna turn on the light so if you guys speak Spanish this is kind of like a little molcajete I think this is called a um, mortar i don't know if i'm saying it right you guys know i don't know how to speak english or spanish but um let's see i actually haven't i should have opened it up just to make sure it's not broken because you know it being from ross it's kind of sus let's see i guess we're gonna find out if it's broken or not okay so it's pretty heavy okay i like that look at how cute this is you guys and it's marble i like that it's heavy the reason why i wanted to get one of these is because i was doing it like the old school way how my mom would do it like sometimes i need to like crush cloves or just sometimes i just need to crush like some spices um i would do it with like a cup or something like a glass cup and i would just squish it like that or like i don't know something heavy but now I can do it the legit way and I could just do it right here. So this one was $7.99. I think that it says the original price is $15, but it's a $7.99. I think this is one of my favorite buys of Ross. That's how you know that you're getting old when like kitchen stuff starts making you happy. Turning into my mom, guys. I also bought these microfiber cloths. So I already use these like to go to the gym, um, but I also use them like for like to keep at my vanity, like whenever I'm taking off like uh, my eye makeup, I like using these cause they're super soft. And I like how they don't, they don't give off a lot of lint. If I use like regular hand towels, the little lint will get in my eye and it's like so hard to get out. And I noticed with the microfiber cloths, it doesn't have as much lint, like when I'm rubbing my eyes, like to clean them. 
So yeah, so I'm gonna use these for the gym and my vanity. Ross had the Clorox brand this time and I bought these dishcloths. Um, all of our dishcloths have been disappearing too, so um, I re-upped on these. It's like a scrubber dishcloth, so I like whenever you're cleaning off the counter and it's like, you know, there's stuff on it, it'll help wipe it off faster. And I like that these are kind of thick, so I'm kind of excited for these. And these were $4.99. The next thing that I got is this drying mat. So this one has two drying mats and what we use these for is we have like a dish rack. We place a mat under it and it just like soaks up the water. Um, ours lasted us a pretty good time but it's time to get rid of it. So I'm glad that this one comes with two. And these were $5.99. And you guys already know my dogs are like my children. So whenever I go out shopping for myself, I try to think of them. And I actually got them a bed, but they're sleeping. Benji's sleeping on it right now. So I got him like this little toy. It doesn't work. Oh my god. Oh, there it goes. Benji and Yuko love playing with toys, you guys. If you guys know Yuko, he's Brit's golden doodle that lives with us. And they both love toys. This is a little patito to duck. You guys, Benj looks a little different because he had to get shaved down for summer. But here, Benj, got you a present, bro. He's yours. He's your new friend. Oh, I think he likes it. I think he likes it, guys. The next thing that I got is this soap dispenser. And this one was eight bucks. But look at how pretty it is, you guys. All right, so I also stepped into the clothing section. I really like Ross for like their chill clothes. I always get my kick it at home clothes at Ross. I got these little shorts to be like around the house in or like to do like, I don't know, like to run errands and stuff. And these are super comfy. I always get my shorts from Ross. I even got these from Ross. I'm, I might have lost a little weight because they fit me a little big now, but these were $7.99. And then I also love wearing sports bras, whether it is to go work out or to run errands or to, to chill at home. I just love sports bras. They're so comfortable. I love the brand Jockey. They have like the best like workout clothes and i found this jockey sports bra this one was only four dollars you guys i love jockey i have like tights from them i have like bralettes from them whenever i'm like showing you guys all the stuff that i got on these hauls i feel like it's a baby shower or something they're always opening up their presents like at the baby shower that's i feel like i feel like i'm doing this with you guys like i'm all showing you guys but Anyways, I also got these shorts as well. I really like the color. I think that's why I got them. Also, the material is not as like thick. So these are more breathable. And I like the pocket. I got these like to chill at home or again like run errands and stuff. The next thing that I got are pillows for my new comforter set. I always like to add on like a different color just to kind of complement whatever color I got for the comforter i feel like ross does have a bigger selection of like pillows like decorative pillows i always find my decorative pillows at ross tg maxx has really cute ones but i feel like ross has a bigger like variety so i got these pillows i honestly don't need any more pillows in my life because i feel like i'm like that like the typical girl who has like a hundred pillows on her bed and like literally that's me but you guys like i love pillows especially because like i sleep with like pillows like i don't know i sleep when like on my lower back like i have one in between my legs and then i hug one like i sleep with like three pillows so the color i was going for was like kind of like a gold color a little bit you guys already know my problem with the walls you guys hear me complain about it all the time so i'm not gonna paint them so i'm just gonna work with them if you can't win them join them so we join the wall so we're gonna work around the wall honestly i don't even know how this is gonna come out because sometimes it works and sometimes it doesn't. So if it doesn't work, then it's okay. We'll just redo. You know, you guys will just get another Ross haul. The last thing that I got was this little Netflix and chill set. And then it comes with like these little shorts. Once I put it on, it's gonna look tight. Right now it looks a little crazy, but. So yeah, I like this little set for whatever I'm gonna chill at home, watch a movie, maybe chill with someone. This set, you guys, was only $6.99. So I really like this set. If you're a skinny person, um, you could wear this out. 
but me since my my booty's a little too big it wouldn't look very flattering on me to wear out in public um so that's how we'll probably wear it at home but but i think someone skinny could pull that off all right guys so i think that's it for the ross haul so now we're just gonna get right into the TJ Maxx haul. So whenever I go to TJ Maxx, I always go into like the hairspray area or like the beauty area. And I always get my shampoo from there, you guys, because I love Joyco. So I haven't tried this one. I don't think the anti anti anti-fade conditioner by Joyco. I don't think I've tried it. I've tried the regular Joyco. They didn't have the regular kind, um, so I just got this one. Um, but these are 20 bucks. Originally, they're 40 bucks. And I love Joyco. I also use Redken, but I mainly use the Joyco one. I just love how smooth it leaves your hair. And I have like really frizzy hair, and it's just thick so this helps it smooth out so much and it stays soft and shiny so highly recommend and I've been kind of filling the hair up do so I got some clips I like these clips too because like I said I have like thick hair um, obviously I also have extensions so I need something that's gonna hold and I love these type of clips because if you have like thick hair or long hair these will really hold and I love that it comes with all these colors because since my hair is red, it's kind of hard to like match it. But I love how it comes with like brown. It comes with like a red one, a purple one, and a black one. So we got one for every occasion. These were $6. I also got this Bed Head Super Smoothing Cream. I used to use this. I haven't used this in a few years. But I honestly, I feel like I buy more hair products than what I do like makeup and stuff. I mean, I do have a lot of makeup, but I feel like I'm always into buying like hair products just because I love anything that's going to make my hair smooth. Like you guys, if you guys have like thick like hair that's like frizzy or hard to manage, always try always try to invest on like good hair stuff because it's gonna help so much so but i go to tj maxx because i'm a baller on a budget so that's how we keep it together but let me see it okay it smells super good and the reason why i like this is because it adds so much shine to your hair and it smooths it out it makes it like more soft and also it'll keep it smooth if your hair tends to like frizz out like when you're like you know when you're at the club or something or it's like stuffy this keeps your hair smooth this one is the bedhead after party i also got this anti-aging serum it has a vitamin c and retinol so i have sunspots they're genetics guys i already use sunscreen i've been using sunscreen since i was like 13 but my mom has them it just runs in the family so and then i i have freckles so it's just kind of like bound to happen but it's okay i'll live so i heard vitamin c and retinol is really good i got this one it's called province beauty i don't know how good it is it's my first time using it i'm just gonna try it out and see how I like it. And if I like it, I'll probably buy like a better brand because I'm not really familiar with this brand. Okay guys, so since Benji is shaved right now, if you guys have seen Benji before, you guys know he's a fluffy dog. Like he gets super fluffy. So I feel like whenever he gets shaved down, he doesn't feel like himself. And I know that sounds crazy like if you're not a, like a pet owner, but like you know when you're like your pet starts acting different like because you know their personality so i always buy him like clothes whenever i shave him down so he doesn't feel like naked because i know that that's why he feels weird he probably feels naked um so i got him this little i don't know it's a little it looks like a tourist shirt it has like uh it has like palm trees on it but usually I buy him a sweater, but right now it's a little hot and I don't want him to be too hot. So I just got him this little shirt to put on top. But look at how cute it is, you guys. It's a little collar shirt. I hope it fits him because he's kind of long. So we'll see. But another thing that I found was this decorative pillow. Um, this is to go with my comforter set. I wanted two of these, but they didn't have like, they only had this one. So I just bought one. But then I ended up going to Ross and I found the other two. So I'm not sure how it's going to all come together. 
But what I will say is that this feels like super good quality. I will say that about TJ Maxx, like their stuff, their decorative pillows are super good quality. This one was 17, but honestly, the quality is really good and you can tell it's not gonna like flatten or like, you know, mess up anytime soon. So I really like this pillow. And oh my God, you guys, we went camping and I left all my blankets in my dad's bus. So I have no, I don't have no throw on blankets. I had to steal that one from like the living room. Um, so I went and I bought another one. So I love throw on blankets, you guys. I always get them from TJ Maxx. And I always get like the soft ones. These are so comfy to sleep in, especially if you want to take a little nappy nap nap or you wanna watch a movie. Um, so yeah, I got the cream color. Um, this one was 20 bucks. The next thing that I got was a bathroom mat. So Mama's had an accident on it because she must, she thought it was a training pad. I don't lay down pads for her no more. I take her outside, but I don't know. I think she just thought it was a pad and she had an accident on it. So, this is like probably the fifth mat I buy. So here's another mat that I'm replacing because of mamas. And I got this one and it has two. And honestly you guys, it's been a struggle being without a mat because I hate when my feet are cold and it just sucks getting out of the shower dripping wet and the floor is so cold. So I'm so thankful I got these. And you guys already know, me and my family do so many summer activities. So I needed a beach towel, you guys. And they have so many cute beach towels at TJ Maxx. They have like a big variety of them. And this one has like little pineapples on it. And I also got um, some new bed sheets. So these say Pro Chill. Let's see if it's true. Cause I did just get some pillows and they're supposed to stay cold. And dude, I got them from Walmart. And honestly, they do stay kind of cold. I don't know what's in them or what, how they're made, but they stay kind of cold. So I'm kind of excited for these. So we'll see. But these were 20 bucks. I was gonna buy another white comforter, but I was gonna buy like a legit one. Like, I don't know, like one from like Macy's or something. I just feel like I can't keep up with white comforters cause I'm always eating like, I'm like, I'm sorry guys, I'd be eating on my bed. I know some people hate doing that, but I'd be snacking and stuff. I tried my best to find a good color that doesn't look crazy with the color of the wall. So I don't know guys, let's just see if it's a fail or not. I got this comforter and this one's from Vera Wayne, girl. She's bougie. And you know what? Actually, TJ Maxx always has a lot of Vera Wayne stuff, uh, but I really like this comforter. I like the color. I'm a big fan of the color. Um, I don't know if you could see it that good right now, but I think once it's on the bed, you'll be able to see the color better. It's kind of like a sage color, but then it's kind of like a light, light, light blue. I don't know how to explain it. So this Vera Wing set was $100, and this one is a queen. So we're gonna see how it all comes together. The only thing is, guys, I did forget to buy curtains that would like go with everything. So I don't know. Let's just see what happens. All right, so I'm gonna show you guys what my bed looks like right now. So I used to have a white comforter, but I put this old pink one on because the white one just got messed up. So I put this one on for now. Luckily, my pillows went with everything. I also got a new carpet since the last time you guys seen it and it just didn't work. So I got a gray one. Um, I got it before I bought everything so I don't know we'll just see how it comes together okay are you guys ready okay guys I think I like it I think that it doesn't look too bad I think I like it I think it doesn't look too bad with the wall um, I'm probably gonna change the color of the curtains maybe to like I don't know maybe like a tan color or like a beige color just cause I don't know how I feel about all of that, but I for sure like the way that the comforter looks. But I feel like you guys can see the, the color a little better. It looks cute or whatever. 
I got that little trick from um, the ladies that help us deep clean and they do this little trick with the blankets and I don't know I picked it up on I picked it up from them it looks cute whatever I have this one from my old set yeah I think it looks better with that one on I don't know maybe I'm just overdoing it because I love pillows but I think it looks cute or whatever. And that is it for today's haul, you guys. I hope you guys liked it. Let me know if you guys like the stuff that I got and how you guys feel about the comforter set. Thank you guys so much for watching. Let me know what was your favorite item that I got from this haul. Don't forget to hit the like button. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button. And thank you guys so much for watching Mo Money's channel.